Welcome to Let's Play Forza Motorsport 4 Part 105, and do not adjust your set. This is the same car as I used in the last segment, except in a nice midnight purple. Um, I tried this with the other two Koenig segs that are available to me. Not a chance in hell. Absolutely none. And I don't have the Azure, because I don't have that DLC, apparently. I thought I pre-ordered this game, but apparently I don't. I don't know. I don't have that DLC. And I didn't also, I don't think I also, also don't think I bought the bonus pack or something. Or maybe I just don't have any of the DLC, I don't fucking know. Point is, I'm using the CCGT again. And we're gonna go to the Koenigsegg Showcase, which is for all three Koenigseggs, four if you have the, the Azera. And yeah, this is a thing. And, uh, I tried it with the, uh... Well, I didn't even try it with the CC8S because the PI couldn't even get close to high enough, and the CCX was uh, impossible to control, and also it couldn't actually get up to 861, unlike Weber and Esposito can somehow through Space Magic, so. CCGT it is. Alright, um, attempt two. I wrecked. The end. Ah, damn it. Alright. So yeah, definitely gonna have to drive pretty hard here in order to have a chance of victory. Let's try to dive it into the first turn and get around that uh, Weber and Esposito immediately. And hooray, I succeeded without actually damaging uh, my car. Script the paint, but that's about it. Let's dive underneath Evans for third. That's a nice little dive. Please stop car. Please stop car. Please stop. No. Oh. Uh, counter steering. Son of a bitch. Counter steering is so hard in this game. Like to do not shittily. I'm honestly surprised I didn't spin it. Like, that, that was, any other time that, like, 99% of the time that would have been a spin. I don't know how the fuck that happened. That didn't happen. Happened a bad. Unfortunately, it's probably not going to translate to a win. But. Because I lost all that time to Muller and Rossi here. Please stop sliding, car. I forgot how unstable this car can be if you, like, drive it hard like I'm doing here. Since I didn't really have to do that at Silverstone in the last segment, but it's kind of necessary here. Alright, come on, slipstream on Muller here. No, I don't need first gear. Fuck first gear. We're, we're staying out of first gear. I don't want to spin the tires any more than I already do. No more. Alright, now let's close this one second gap on Rossi here. Ooh, Rossi's sliding a bit out of the turn. Nice. I saw those tire marks. Oh, Rossi's sliding some more. Looks like I'm not the only one that has those, some struggles keeping this thing uh, under control. Even the AI is uh, getting a little slidey here. Is there an Audi R8 LMS Ultra? Um, I don't know about the Ultra. I think the Audi R8 LMS is in this game, though, if I remember correctly. I can't remember when, like, the, the GT... Like the not prototype Audi R8 debuted. So, yeah. Anyways, um, it's retard dive time. So, Rossi, sorry, not sorry. But I want to win this race. Hey, no mechanical damage. Sweet. Oh, no. He wasn't given up. Oh, 
Well, that happened. Okay, race one complete. Oh, boy. So, yeah, this is a wonderful adventure of uh, massive wa time wasting trying to get this first race completed. But hey, time wasting is what I do best, apparently. Anyways, let's move on to race number two, as I reluctantly continue to use this uh, CCGT because of my own stubbornness. Okay, time for race two at the Hockenheim Ring, doing the national circuit, so. Gotta remember that, down straight away. Two laps, let's go. Nice burnout on the launch. And diving into turn one, like only you can at Hockenheim and also Nürburgring. Nice dive underneath Muller for second. Didn't even like attempt that, it just kinda happened. Hooray. Alright. We're alright to second place, good. That greatly increases my chance of winning. I just gotta be nice and cool. And get around Rossi in a timely manner. Or I could just dive like an idiot. I don't know why I thought he was going to leave the door open enough for me there, but I'm dumb. Alright, got a bunch of front-end damage now. I was kind of hoping to pass him for the stadium section because I didn't want to lose time to him in the stadium section, but... Okay, impromptu dive. I just outbroke myself there. Oh well. Oh, hi! Also, there's other cars in this race. And I just got... God damn it. Well, throughout all those uh, attempts at, like, taking the lead, I've fallen down the fourth. Son of a fucking cock. Now I'm gonna have to try even harder. Especially now that I have a shit ton of front-end damage, because I refuse to actually, like, not destroy my car, apparently. Had to make that dive on more. Absolutely had to. I can still win this. I just have to not be raging retard like I was last the last lap. There we go. Nice dive. Overtake clear. Now I just gotta hold him off for the rest of the lap. My tongue decided couldn't decide on whether to say lap or race there, so it just went la. Hooray. Now. Around stadium sections, just keep it nice and tidy. Don't slide the car, be mindful of the gaps. Okay, pull a slight gap on Rossi down that straight. Couple links on them, so we're good. Hey, first attempt to at race two. Nice. Okay. Two down, two to go. Sweet. And here comes everyone else across the line. Basically, the not CCGTs. They battle amongst themselves, and we shall. Uh, Move on to race three. Get another affinity level up. Yay! Good. All right, race three, Silverstone. This time the uh, international circuit for three laps, as opposed to the Grand Prix circuit for six. Ooh. Johansson almost did the bad thing. Aka turning. Hard right into me off the start. Actually, he tried to do it, but I was just clear of him. Thankfully. Holy crap. Can you say no grip? Jesus. The car didn't want any of that turn. Hi, how you doing? If 
you haven't noticed, I'm being super aggressive in these races. They're short, I don't care. It's either do it this way or spend a fucking hour trying to win one race. And I've kind of, uh, I'm kind of in don't give a fuck mode right now. It's more make progress at any cost except blatantly cheating. Fucking hair on my tongue. It was really, really bothering me. I couldn't like get a hold of it down the straights, despite my best efforts. Oops, slide into the turn again. That was just me, kind of a little late on the brakes and also late on the turn in that time. Oh well. All right, Rossi. Come at me, bruv. That's why I need a helmet, yes, clearly. Hey, Sleen. Long time no see. Oh, shit. How you doing, Rossi? Welcome to the Forza Zone. Got the lead. Got one more lap. And I actually got a really good exit out of the last turn. I just gained a shit ton of time on Rossi. I like how the second half of the field are so far behind the uh, GTs. By like, I mean, fuck. That's why I couldn't use any other car. Because these things are just OP as far as the... Uh, four Koenig segs in the game. I can't really say about the Jera, but at least the three available uh, like, from like vanilla content. There we go. That's what I was thinking of. I still want to check to see if I have like any DLCs downloaded after this, after I record this segment. I can't remember if I left some downloaded or not. Series. This is the uh, Koenigsegg Showcase. Ooh. By the way, we're getting close to the end of the European manufacturer races, finally. Woo. Isn't that fucking cool? We've only done like 700,323 of them. You know. Hey, I won another race. Quite nicely, actually. And there's everyone else, just kind of, uh, in their own little race. Right. So with that one race remaining here, another affinity level up, which means another 25 grand for me, and let's go to the finale. Alright, let's try that again. This time not get distracted by test drive appearing in the chat. <laughs> you bastard! Alright, Bernie's out. It's reverse. Looks like the medium length course. I don't fucking know. So, let's not, um, crash into turn one and spin the car this time. Shall we? There we go. Much, much better. Alright, we're around the slow cars. Now let's, uh, attack the, the... freaking trio here. Oh, it's the short, short course. Okay. Never mind. Apparently I'm bad at reading maps. Hooray. Can I sneak underneath Muller here? Answer is yes. Oh, he's still alongside. Now he isn't. Sweet. Oh shit, careful with those curves. Those curves are evil. Spell the death and destruction. 
you know, as much as I like the Bernese Alps, like, as a track and to drive around, the reverse, going in reverse is just fucking awful. I actually don't like the reverse Alps that much at all. Thoughts on Drive Club? I haven't played the game yet because I don't have a PS4, but I would like to play it. And it will definitely be my first purchase once I get a first game purchase once I do get a PS4 eventually. That's my thoughts on Drive Club. It looks like a good game. I definitely want to play it a lot. Like, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Alright, made it up second. It's a nice little dive on Evans now. Just gotta get around Rossi. Ooh, Rossi a little slidey out of the turn. Gives me the inside, he backs off, and P1 I go. Alright. Well, I know about GT Sport, but it's not out yet, therefore... I can't really buy a game that hasn't been released yet. Oh, hello Rossi, how are you? Oh shit, he's on my inside. Give him room, don't don't be an asshole. PS2 games 1440p orgasmic. So yeah, how about that new graphics card? Test drive, sure enjoying it. You and your graphics whoriness. Goddamn whore. Oh, boy, I'm sliding. Dirt today, Tona, 1440p is beautiful, I can imagine. Test drive, when is your, uh... PCSX2 1440p with a wheel LP of Dirt today, Tona happening? Big slide out of the final turn, but I have the momentum and I have the gap and I win. I have the victory. Yay! Okay, well, this is not the car I wanted to use for this series, but hey, it's whatever. So, sometimes I have to make sacrifices for the greater good of my sanity. So, you know. But there we go. You gonna get another affinity level up? Yes, I do. Another 35 grand for me, so. There we go. The Koenigsegg showcase is done. And, uh, yeah. As much as I didn't want to use the CCGT, it was my only choice. And with that, we shall move on to our next series and the next segment where it'll be more, probably more shenanigans, considering the car I want to use. But, uh, stay tuned for that and find out.